check this out. So this is the text of speech program. Sinfall. This is where Dinathria sired his first court of harvesters ages upon ages ago. You see that? So basically every time you click on an NPC, it would automatically just read it out. So even if you go to like something like this, it'll read it. Desire. Venter are mostly loyal servants, but they function best when properly motivated. That's awesome, right? So this is how you install that. So this is the website. This is uh, Joycey, I think it's pronounced. Uh, Joycey.com. Um, I'm going to link it in the description. So normally you can just download it if you're playing on the live servers right up here. Just hit the download button and that's it. Painless. But if you're going to be playing on a private server like I am and I'm playing on Firestorm, which is version 9.2.7, you have to remember that what version you're on. So this this works with every single add-on you ever use if you want to know what version you're playing on you could easily get to this screen and look on the bottom left and it will tell you what version you're playing on so down here if you scroll down you can see old versions um, the top one is 9.0.5 which is the latest one that you can find for this text-to-speech program and it works so download the top one and once you get that downloaded you're gonna extract it uh, extract the folder at least to your wow folder so you go to your world of warcraft um like for example i'm, I'm on my firestorm server one um you're gonna go to interface you're gonna go to add-ons and then in here you just drop it right there you see joyce.com text to speech wow you just drop in that folder in there boom no problem um another thing you're gonna need in there because inside the folder is the actual text to speech monitor program so here it is right here joyce.com text up papa i i recommend either putting it on your desktop or adding it to your side like one of your bar or whatever like you see for example i put it on my bar so it's ready to go i could just click on it and that's it so um let me launch it from here and then uh the first thing you need to do every time you launch this program is you go over to the options tab and then you go to monitor display and in here you're going to click on create image you'll see that That's little line pop speech. up and then you click on capture image and that's going to fill that results page you see that by the way you don't have to do this every time i learned shortly after making this video that if you just load up the program it will automatically just start reading stuff you may need to do that process though for your very first time so if it's not reading off stuff immediately then follow what i just said and it should work for you once you have that set up that's it now you just go in the game and you let the thing Desire. read are mostly loyal service if you want to do any modifications properly. because at first um it's going to start with this thing in the center of your screen here and this is going to be some extra things that you can set up um, because it does also read off chat so when somebody says something in chat in local like say chat or whatever it will read it off to you and even your own words so let's say if i say hi in chat you see, it actually says it and I can hear it. That's fucking awesome. It does that little microphone, that, that walkie talkie sound to let you know that it's an actual player saying this right now. Even if they use an emote too, it does the same thing where it'll actually read off the emote that they're using. Um, so with this, I mean, you can modify it if you want. I didn't touch any of this, honestly. I didn't do anything with it. I just took this bar and I dragged it over to the side that's it just got rid of it so it's away from my field um but there's other parameters in here so you can um, also like stop and you can play this again so if you want to you know pause it for a second and you're going to step away and then you come back and you want to have it re read you can do that or you can also use the scroll wheel up to make it Desire. read and scroll Enter wheel down to stop it so that's another option Something I forgot to mention is the little box that you drag away, you can modify it so that it filters what kind of speech you want to have. So for example, if you see like the speech bubbles that pop up, sometimes they're actually voice acted and then other times they aren't. So if you want to have the text speech program always read those out, you can go under this box here and make sure that NPC message 
are both checked so right here and right here so the first one is going to trigger the actual speaking the second one makes a little beep sound just to let you know that a chat is going to happen so like this usually happens also with people talking in the world too so if, if i say something in the game it's going to make the beep sound to basically let you know that a player is possibly speaking as well. And if you end up doing this method of leaving the text-to-speech program read the, the boxes, like the actual um, text bubbles, then you, you should also go into the settings, go to sound, and disable dialogue. Because otherwise you're gonna hear the voice actor speaking over the text-to-speech program, and that's really annoying. So yeah, you basically have to choose one or the other. Thankfully, in the newer expansions, I've noticed that most times when you see an NPC bubble, they're usually voice acted. So that's why I'm leaving the dialogue on and I usually disable the text -to speech program from reading off those those text bubbles. Another really cool thing also is if you click on those three lines right there, it will pull up this menu. And in here, you can actually change how you want your name to be said. So like, for example, my name is scriptures, but I spell it with Z's. So the way that it pronounces it is Z scriptures Z, which is not the right way. <laughs> so, so basically I changed it to the normal scriptures with S's and it says it properly. So that's a really cool little feature uh, in case it's mispronouncing your name or you wanted to just say some, something completely different. You can go ahead and do that. But yeah, um, it, it works extremely well. Um, I highly recommend it because this makes the story so much more enjoyable to do, like ridiculously more enjoyable to the point where like I feel like I'm playing a completely different game now, especially knowing that I, I know what's happening because I feel like most people, including myself, when I was playing uh, MMOs my whole life, I never actually read the story of anything. I would just click on the fucking thing, I'll, I'll accept the quest, and, and that, that's it. Like, don't even read it. You know, like, that's it. You know? <laughs> so it's, it's always about just accepting as many quests as possible, and then just run and go do the quest. And then, and then you're sitting there like, wait, um, oh shit, there's an actual mechanic to this? I didn't know I was supposed to read. Especially when you're playing, like, World of Warcraft, like, the, the classic where they don't show you exactly where quests are all the time. You know, sometimes you, you'll just like, you know, brain fart and you're just running around like mindless, like a, like a chicken with the head caught off, trying to figure out what you're supposed to do with the quests and getting like frustrated with yourself because you didn't read, you know? <laughs> so at least in this uh, version, you can actually sit here with this text-to-speech program and read every single thing reading, you know? We, I don't want to read, man. It's 2023, man. I need voice acting in every Every single game I play, I don't care what it is, I need voice acting and I'm, I'm hoping that the future of video games is going to be all like AI driven voice if they can't have an actual voice actor in the game. You know what I mean? Like we need that in every game now. So yeah, this got me spoiled. So it's it's awesome. Highly recommend this, this add-on. It's the best one for sure.